the best outlet in town. I mean, honestly, I, they can't have a better uh, amateur MMA organization in the country. I mean, you're in Las Vegas, it's the fight capital of the world. I mean, you've got Randy Couture that comes to these things regularly. Frank Mir, who's fighting for the UFC Heavyweight Championship, he comes here regularly. Tough Enough does their thing, and I'm really just happy to be a part of it. For not only the organization, but for uh, amateur fighters coming up, they really don't have a forum to show what they have and the talent that they have. And we've given them something to where they can. I'll look at the weight division, look at what experience they have, watch them train, and, and put them up against somebody I think they can compete against until they get the experience. I love the Tough Enough organization. I think it's a great venue for the amateur fighters. It's ran very professionally, so they have an idea what it's going to be like. You don't have a lot of the hokey stuff I've seen in other venues where it's like, well, you're fighting this guy, and five minutes before you fight, they're switching out opponents, and just the craziest things. You see weight classes where guys, you know, 15 pounds over, made no attempt to make weight, and you're fighting him anyways. The only thing different between really this venue and a pro venue is we're not getting, you know, the amateurs aren't getting a paycheck at the end of the night, so. I think it's good. It gives a lot of guys an opportunity to get a little taste of what it's like. And with the two-minute rounds, it's not too stressful. Obviously, a ring is a little different than a cage. It would be a little more ideal to be in a cage. They seem to be pretty on time with their shows, which I appreciate as a trainer. My name is Barry Meyer. I'm the president and founder of Tough Enough Productions. It was founded in 1994 in Chicago, Illinois. It is an avenue for amateurs. I saw the very first UFC, and being a martial artist since I was five years old, it was instantaneous love at first fight. I'm basically a feeder system. I find fighters to go into the bigger levels. Fortunately, we've had some fighters go into the UFC, like John Fitch, Shoney Carter, Aaron Riley, Rob Emerson, have all competed for Tough Enough, and now, uh, now they're in the main stage on the UFC. so many fights, roughly 15 to 20 fights per month, so we can easily say we've had hundreds of fighters go through the Tough Enough ring. Whether I made a penny an hour or I lost money, this is a pure love. I left the job doing hedge funds and commodity trading. This is a pure passion. I eat, sleep, drink, and breathe mixed martial arts. So it's uncalculable as far as how much time and effort and thought goes into these shows.